Hi friends, welcome to a new video. Today I have a coats and boot haul for you. So if you'd like to see the bits that I picked up, then stay tuned. Me love every woman in the world. The girls them pretty like diamonds and pearl. But a one girl me no want. So hi guys, welcome to a new video. Hello if you are new over here. Hi, my name's Jody. Over on this channel I do everything to do with plus size fashion. Along with plus size fashion, I also like to talk about body positivity, self-love, and just embracing um embracing the body that you were given <laughs> and the body that we have. Um just living in your um perfectly imperfect body uh so yeah i love to promote body confidence i also talk about chronic illnesses over here because i have a few chronic illnesses myself and i think it's so important to talk about these issues and just raise awareness really um and yeah i'm a mum with two sons i do like to vlog so you'll see that over here too and i love a little bit of hair makeup and skincare um, so you'll also see that here too. So there's a little bit of everything over here. Um, if that sounds like a channel you would like to be part of, I would love to have you be part of my YouTube family. All you need to do is click the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell because that will notify you every time I upload a new video. And at the end of this video, if you do like it, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It really, really means so much when you interact with my video, giving me a thumbs up, commenting down below. Um, it's uh, a real honour for me to receive your messages. I love hearing about you as a person, about what you loved uh, um, in my video, what you'd like to see. Um, so please do comment. Um, so today I have, first of all, I'm so sorry that you guys are only getting to see me once a week at the moment. I'm just really struggling. As you guys know, I've already said it in other videos. Um, I'm just struggling, uh, I don't know, with my illness and just finding the balance with filming and stuff. So I'm only managing to get one video out a week, um, which normally I have two videos a week. So hopefully we will be back to two videos. Just give me some time and I'll get there eventually. Um, but yeah, so today um, is a coat and boot haul. This comes highly requested um, just by quite a lot of people just saying they'd like to see what coats are out there and they'd like to see boots. So I feel like um, I'm gonna merge it into two. I did order the coat from ASOS, but I did order the boots from Simply B. So it's a little bit of a mixture um, in terms of like places, but all of the items that um, you will see today in this video will be linked in my description box down below. Um, so if you do like anything, you can tap on the link down below. It will take you straight over to the item, whether that be at Simply B or um, ASOS. Um, so yeah. What else have I got to say? You guys know what size I am. I'm a size UK 24, sometimes a 26 on the bottom half. It just really depends on what I'm ordering. Sometimes I could be a 22. It really depends on how I want it to fit, what I'm ordering it, what I'm ordering it, <laughs> what I'm ordering and where I'm getting it from. So it, there's a whole, you know, um, and definitely say that different brands do vary in sizes. So you know, it's just a number. As long as you um, are happy um, within yourself and you're happy to order whatever size so it fits you and you feel comfortable in it, then that, that's the main thing. Um, I will put on the screen the item somewhere over here and also put the um, size so you can see for reference. And I also will have my measurements down in the description box in case you need to work out how an item may fit you by comparing um, your measurements to mine so they will be also down there um, so without further ado let's stop talking let's stop talking because I can't talk anyway <laughs> and uh, let's get the first item on okay friends so we're starting off with this River Island long puffer coat now this is size 26 and this comes up quite small um, because every coat I have is a size 24 or 26. So I would definitely say first off this comes up quite small um, because I cannot do it up. Um, however, it is a really nice coat. This kind of reminds me of a coat that I had quite a few years back um, that I picked up from Matterland. I loved it and I wore it to death. Um, 
I think I still have it, but it's a size 18, so never going to fit me now. Um, so let's come a bit closer so you guys can see the detailing. So you've got all of this like gold detailing. You know, River Island um, are very um, known for their, you know, hardware on their um, clothing to be really nice, um, sturdy and just look really pretty and beautiful. Um, these are gold, as you can see here. You've got um, a nice fur hood put it up so you've got a nice fur hood which is quite nice um feels lovely uh i mean i'm just very disappointed that you can't that i can't do it up let's see is there pockets okay so you have got pockets um but the pockets are like you know the little zips that you get these are like tiny little zips so you've got that little zip on the side um, but yeah, you've got a nice size pocket um, and then you do have this really lovely pretty belt. Um, if I do it up, you just have to pop that in. So you do have a really lovely belt here that you can, once done up, you can cinch yourself in. I do really love that. I think it would give it a really nice look had it um, fitted me. Um, just to draw you in and give you that shape so yeah it is a nice jacket but just for sizing I would definitely say that if you like this I'd definitely say size up um, maybe size up even twice because I don't have like thick um, thick clothing underneath even so if to wear like a, a thicker knitwear jumper this is not knitwear but to wear a knitwear under this you would definitely need to maybe size up twice um, so I definitely think that these run a bit small, um, but it is a really nice coat. It's very warm. I'm very, very warm. Um, and I like the length in it. So this is the length here, as you can see, um, a nice length. It's kind of like, I would say like midi length. So halfway from my knee to my ankle. So the length is beautiful. Um, and it's a black, it's a black kind of like shiny puffer coat. So yeah this is the first one let's get the next one on okay so next up we have this kind of like double breasted trench kind of look coat that's what i'd call it i don't know the full name but it will be here somewhere um it's like a wool material i'm not really used to this type of material coat and it's kind of like something that maybe i'd need to get used to um in terms of i don't know just I really love like a trench coat, but this one, I don't know, it's just not hitting the spot for me, uh, but it is really nice. I love the colour of this coat. This is just like a really nice colour. Um, let me come a bit closer so you guys can see. So it's, um, you can actually do it all the way up like this. You've got buttons on either side here. Um, nice kind of big collar opening um and then you've got this belt here which is really nice because you can cinch yourself in um and then i've done it up as you can see it fits really well it's a size 26 i'd definitely say the sizing is much better i would personally myself like with winter coats always go for a size 26 at the moment um with the size that i am just because obviously it gives me that extra room to like feel comfortable and just maybe put something thicker underneath if i wanted to however this jacket um coat shall i say is very quite warm um so i wouldn't necessarily feel like you need anything too thick underneath um you could wear like a cute little roll neck underneath um and yeah like it let me undo it so you guys can see what it looks like undone um so yeah i wouldn't necessarily wear it um without the belt because i just think it's not flattering at all but you could however wear it just like open uh kind of thing like just like an open coat which is quite nice um i like that i pretty much wear all of my sort of trench coats open like this but then, you know, I just thought I'd take full advantage of this um, tie. It's quite heavy, so it feels quite heavy hanging on the coat. Uh, so if you wasn't going to wear it, maybe you could take it off or just tie it around the back. But um, it's a nice colour. It's nice and thick. And um, it's nice and true to size. The sizing's great. Let me turn around so you can see the back. The length is lovely. This is the back of the coat. So yeah, I do think it's nice. 
um, but just uh, something about it, it's just not hitting the spot. Um, but overall, it is a very well made coat, very nice and warm. And yeah, so let's get on to the next coat. Okay, so next up, we have this trench coat. I think it's a trench coat. It's kind of like a like rain macking material. It's quite like um, that type of material. If the rain drops, it's going to just like slide off of you. Can you tell that I love like a, a trench looking type of coat? I really like this one. Um, it's very different to anything that I have. I'm loving the colour. It's kind of like a chocolate brown colour. I'm wearing this in a UK size 24. The sizing is absolutely perfect. Um, I just really like this. You've got nice, uh, two nice big pockets at the front here. And yeah, I just like it. Let me come a bit closer. Um, this is, it has like a big massive collar on, um, which is, I just like it. Very stylish. Uh, you've got a tie around the waist. It doesn't have any buttons or anything like that. So it's just one that you will use the tie up. Let me undo it so you guys can see what it looks like undone so you could just wear it as just like an open style coat like so um which i think is very nice uh the sizing is really great it's quite i'd say quite generous in sizing um but it's, it's very comfortable like for me um it's not too thick and i like that i don't i don't like coats that are just too thick that make me feel like i'm overheating i like to layer up so personally i would prefer a bit of a thinner coat and then layer underneath that's my preference um so the last two for me are just a little bit too thick where this is like perfect because i feel like i can put a jumper under these a turtleneck and um maybe a scarf or whatever and i just feel like i can layer myself up and um keep myself warm that way instead of having like a real thick coat um so yeah this is not too um it's not too um thick as you can see it's quite thin the color's beautiful i don't have anything like this i really like this um let's do it off again so yeah like like i said there's nothing um there's no belt i mean there's no button to kind of um button you up but you've got this tie around the waist so you can just tie yourself up this is lovely i like this so this definitely out of the three that i've tried on so far this is definitely uh, my favorite um so far but yeah very very comfortable guys it feels cooling on like quite cooling which is nice and nice i like that <laughs> um so yeah this definitely gets a thumbs up from me so this coat is a coat that i've put in my basket taking it out put it in taking it out put it in um and let's see if we can just do it up um i really like the look of it on the model um but it's just one of those ones that i just wasn't sure about but i wanted to obviously show you guys because i thought it was a a, a nice winter coat um it's very very roomy i'm not quite sure what size i'm wearing if it's a 24 or the 26 um but it's kind of like a thick parka coat um has it got anything to draw the sun okay hold on a second okay yes we do okay so you have these in here so let's tighten this up a little bit so we can give ourselves a little bit of a waist and see if that makes any difference the only thing is this is a bit of a kerfuffle isn't it having to do this um let's see okay so that makes a little bit of difference to the shape um so yeah so this is um a puffer a proper a, a parker jacket but quite it's a quite thick one i do have like a parker jacket like this but it's again like quite the thin material not very like not very great for like really cold weather where this is like really great for cold weather because it has this really comfy can you see really comfy inside which almost feels like a blanket um so this is one that like if you like to keep warm and you want to be wrapped up this is one that's going to keep you really nice and warm um it is very warm i like the length in it the length's great it's right on my knees um got nice big pockets at the front the sleeves are nice and long they feel nice and warm um quite big 
I feel a bit like a Michelin man in this, I'm not going to lie. Um, and I just don't like coats that are too, like, make me feel too puffy. But I know that in a really cold weather, this is just going to be perfect. And actually, I don't think it looks too bad. Um, but yeah, I just feel too padded out personally uh, but it is really really nice in terms of like the um quality of it and the feel of it and just the thought of like wearing this in really freezing cold weather just makes me feel warm and cozy um so yeah this is the next one let me show you the back this is the back Oh my god guys i'm actually dying i'm so hot but i definitely feel like having to do those things on the inside just to give you a little bit of shape um is definitely needed because otherwise it just looks like too you know bulky and too big so doing that bit on um doing that bit just tying the inside is a little bit um of a help to give you that little bit of shape so yeah this is this one personally it doesn't it doesn't tickle my tickle my fancy the way I thought it would um but nevertheless it is a really nice coat it's lovely and thick and you know if this is your type of coat I'd definitely say give it a try if you like a nice thick warm coat then I'd definitely say give it a try for me I'm just more into like a thinner coat but I drive and obviously I have chronic illness so I'm not really always out in the cold too much um because of my bones and stuff so you know um having a really thick coat is not really like on my agenda really having to make sure because I'm not really out in the cold as much but if you are really out in the cold a lot I definitely say this is definitely one to try because it is very warm it's very comfy um and yeah it's just yeah a really nice big comfy um coat to have for the winter month okay so next up we have this ASOS curve coat um and this is not too bad um again it's quite padded but not overly padded so i could i could work with this one uh, the last one was so overly padded it was just making me feel not great um but this one is not too bad i'm wearing a size 24 um and i definitely say the sizing's okay um i could do the buttons up but i personally oh my god i just hate feeling restricted so i'm just like i ha hardly do any of my coats up um but yeah i want to show you like my own coats i'm gonna um actually put a coat um i'm gonna get my uh, one of my coats that i've been wearing regularly and i'll put that on this haul as well i think it's still available as well on um boohoo which personally for me is like the perfect kind of thickness and i feel comfortable and i like it so i'll show you that in a minute but this one is quite nice it's quite um quite stylish um it's got a funny smell to it though because it is like that kind of pu um leathery look uh coat i would say that i do feel like the sleeves personally feel a little bit short on me i don't know why they don't look too short when my arms are down but when I'm moving about, I feel like they just, yeah, I don't know. Um, but you do have this um, kind of drawstring bit here that you can cinch yourself in at a waist, which is great. So although you don't have a belt, you can pull these bits in and just cinch yourself in. You could possibly put your belt over the top. I've seen people do that. Um, but I do like the pattern on this, like the kind of like swirly kind of curvy uh, pattern. Um fully lined uh we have nice big pockets which are great i like the length in this as well i think this one's very very quite stylish um i think this is probably my second best out of the coats that i've showed you so far um but yeah this is uh it's a nice jacket the size i definitely say is like more true to size because I would say like round sort of my hip tummy area I'm a, like 26 and everywhere else I'm a 24 so um yeah possibly possibly could size up but the only thing is when you size up when I size up sometimes they just look too oversized so it's just about obviously looking at the style of the coat and seeing what size will work best for you um but yeah um 
I like this coat, it's not bad. Um, so yeah, thumbs up. Okay friends, so this is my actual coat that I wear um, pretty much on sort of days that I take my boys to do sports um, because I have to go out and watch them do sports. They do rugby and basketball. And this is kind of like my thick coat. Now it's not very, it's not very thick, but it's very warm inside. You've got this like lovely sort of soft um, furry material on the inside. And you do have this um, bit here where you can draw yourself in and give you that little bit of shape. Um, but yeah, this is a, my coat from uh, Boohoo, which I did show this coat a few sort of months ago in one of my Boohoo hauls and um, they kindly sent me out some bits and this was one of the things that I chose which was this lovely coat and personally this coat is just perfect for me in terms of like the thickness it's just spot on like it's warm um, but not overheating warm it's um, thick but not making me feel like I'm just like bloated and feel like I'm blown like like I'm wearing a balloon because a lot of those coats make me feel like I'm just like a balloon um, and it's very uncomfortable feeling whereas this it's warm it does up I think I'm wearing a size 24 or 26 it'll be up on the screen here um, and it does up well uh, it's very comfortable I like the length in it I can wear a jumper underneath it and feel comfortable wearing a jumper under it so I can layer it up it's just the perfect coat for me personally I do actually have this in like a um, like a cream colour which is like a short type of version which is absolutely lovely as well but that's from last winter i don't know if it's still available if it is i'll link it down below as well but this personally is my perfect um this is my perfect sort of winter coat but i wanted to bring you a haul um that would be for everybody so i wanted to show you a few of the coats that are out there at the moment because everybody has their own style everybody likes a different type of coat some people like you know walk a lot or get on buses and public transport so they need that thicker coat and so i hope that within this haul you see something that maybe will suit you in terms of you know having a thicker coat or maybe a thinner coat um but so i will link this down below because i definitely thought it's definitely worth a mention i obviously have shown it in um one of my other hauls which is my boohoo haul but obviously as this is a coat haul i just thought i'd show you some of my own coats so this is a, a, um a boohoo um coat okay friends so now we're going to move on to boots i did say at the beginning i was going to split it into two i meant merge the two into one <laughs> um so now we um have uh showed you all the coats um and now i'm gonna get on to the boots um so first of all i'm actually going to show you a pair that i've already shown you as well um but like um unfortunately when i showed you these boots i did say that i was going to show you a try on portion and i didn't actually add it in just because i had really painful feet at the time um and so it was quite painful to get the shoes on and off so i didn't show you but here we go again <laughs> these boots um oh my god they've been worn and everything um but i wanted to bring them on and show you these boots are boots that i picked up from Shein, and i've worn them i've worn them quite a few times now hence you can see all the lines um where i've kind of stretched them a little bit which is great because they're a bit more comfortable um but they're from the men's section in Shein, um and they're i think a size um what size are these they're size 44 um i think that's either a 9 or a 10 i think a 10 um but they're so lovely they look really nice on and they're so comfy um i feel very stylish in them and yeah i just really like them so i wanted to come back on and show you these boots um again and obviously show them on my feet so um we'll get into the try and clip and i'll show you what they look like on my feet um and i also will link the link for these down below if you are interested in them i just think that they are fab find i really love the fact that you've got this on the front here and this on the back so it makes it a lot easier for me to like kind of pull these onto my feet even though my children help me put my shoes on most of the time um but yeah it does make it a lot easier to get these boots onto your feet with the um the pull hoop at the front and the pull hoop at the back um but yeah they're a lovely beautiful pair of boots and i definitely think they're unisex um nowadays the boots that you see these chunky boots can be worn on men or women so yeah perfect lovely pair of boots 
so these are the Shein boots um, from the man section and I really like these they're very very comfortable um, I think they look great on um, if I stand up so you guys can see the front um, this is the front of them they are um, quite they were quite narrow to start with but um, once I started wearing them quite a few um, times, they've now sort of um, stretched a bit, which is great. And I just think that they're perfect. Like, they they look lovely on and they feel really, really nice. Um, and yeah, so this is those ones. I absolutely love them. okay my lovelies next up we have these boots here i don't know if i can hold both of them up they're so big my and my big feet um so these are the boots they are a um pair of sort of black um block heel boots um which i like let's put one of them down because they're really quite heavy um and i really like this sort of black chain chromey detail around the front here um, and then this little buckle on the side uh, so yeah I thought these were nice I think they were new in as well um, and yeah I always order wide fit in all of the shoes that I get from Simply B extra wide fit um, a size 9 extra wide fit fit me um, I, they've got a little bit of um, elasticated bit here um, and then you've got like a little opening on this side so um, that hopefully will give you a little bit more room if you do have sort of a, a bit of a wider ankle or leg there but um, yeah I did really like these I thought they were very nice very stylish and I think they were new in as well so um, yeah let's get them on and let's see what they look like on okay so next up here we have these um boots and honestly like they are really nice um but unfortunately they don't fit um they don't fit me properly so that's such a shame um they're very nice and wide um at the front here um so we've got a nice bit of room in terms of like the width they've actually got room in the front as well so my feet do not feel like squashed up against the front or anything like that um i love this square heel um I just feel like it's going to give me a lot of support, um, hence to some of the other heels that you get are quite smaller, but this feels very supportive and um, looks really nice as well. Um, so yeah, really like these, but unfortunately, um, if I stand up, if you can see on the inside here, they actually are not going up, uh, they're not going up past my ankle. So that's such a shame i'm not going to force it so if you do have like a little bit of more chunky legs then this is something for you to keep in mind the fact that you know this is not going up but um this is what they look like from the front I've, i think they're a very nice look good looking pair of boots um but yeah just too um too uh, what's the word not big enough around sort of the leg part it goes up to the ankle and then it doesn't go up any further than that so that's such a shame um but yeah this is what they look like and um they're very comfortable i must say very comfortable they feel very comfortable i'm quite surprised how comfortable they are um so yeah that's these ones okay so next up we have these which are like hugs so these are where the make of these are JD Williams um, and they're just like a basically copy or replica kind of thing of hugs um, I've never had a pair of hugs am I even saying that right hugs I don't know um, but I I thought I'd give these a try because um, I'm having really bad problems with my feet at the moment um, so comfort is key and also because I take my children to sports, sometimes, um, you know, going to watch them play their sports and um, just going up and down driving, I just thought this would be a bit more comfortable um, to wear, basically. So, um, yes, I thought I'd give these a try. They're lovely and soft on the inside and they've got a little buckle at the side here um, and the sole looks quite 
sturdy um so yes i thought i'd give these a go um again they are a uh are they wide fit yeah they're an extra wide fit so they're called uh warm boots extra wide fit black in a size nine um so yeah so let's get these on and let's see what these look like oh my goodness me um like i said i've never tried any boots on like this before and they're so comfy i feel like i've got slippers on my feet um i can see why people jumped on this trend of wearing these boots um because they are very very comfortable i will say um, my foot is right at the front though so these don't have as much room as um the last pair that i tried on um but i do feel like these will sort of kind of stretch and then be a bit more comfortable but they are so comfortable at the moment in terms of like the softness all inside i just feel like i've just got a big cloud um just cuddling my toe my feet so that's really nice um and they're very very warm but i do feel like these are not actually suitable to you know walk on um wet grass or anything like that i mean I'm not really quite sure are these actually people wear these out um but to me they just feel like slippers so i'm just not sure whether i'd feel comfortable i think so actually maybe walking on on the pavement but not on grass or anything like that so yeah they are a pair that yeah that would do sort of for every day um but not to do sort of for anything that requires you going out into the wild <laughs> if that makes any sense um but yeah very comfortable um let me show you them from the front let's move my chair to the side um but yeah these are what they look like from the front they are really nice i do really like them um and yeah i think i'm getting converted to these boots and definitely perfect for like everyday school run and stuff like that so yeah these are definitely a nice pair of um boots for kind of doing everyday sort of um chores and stuff like that what you need to get done sort of driving driving great um so yeah i like these thumbs up okay so next up we have these boots i've actually tried these before in one of my sheen hauls but i thought i'd try these again for you i have a lot more followers and so some people may not have seen that last haul so i thought that the ones that i thought were quite comfortable and um a must see or a must have i definitely thought these were really nice and definitely a pair for you guys to um yeah have a look at and you know see that whether they were good for you i think they're lovely color very nice and stylish and they were very very comfortable on um when i tried them on in one of my last simply be hauls so um yeah i thought i'd try these on again again they are in the color taupe and um they are in a extra wide fit nine so let's get them on and let me show you what they look like on okay so here we have these boots i've just tucked these leggings in these weren't the best leggings to wear they're so noisy <laughs> but anyways um yeah these boots are really nice like i said i have actually tried these before in um in one of my last simply b hauls and they are very very comfortable pair of boots i would highly recommend these they are so easy to get on and obviously especially with people um who suffer with chronic illness that struggle putting shoes on and um, bending um and just struggling with their joints these are probably the most easiest boots i've ever put on um i normally obviously have to ask my children to help me with my shoes and boots but these i can actually get on myself so um i would highly recommend these um in terms of comfort style and um just comfortability and try and um getting on shoes yourself these are definitely a, a, a thumbs up for these um but yeah these are what they look like on they're very nice i personally wouldn't probably wear them with <laughs> these um but yeah really nice with a nice pair of jeans or a nice pair of just normal leggings not shiny ones like these um that make loads of noise <laughs> Um, but yeah, if I stand up for you so you guys can see what they look like on, move this chair out of the way. Um, this is what they look like at the front. 
come a bit closer um this is a side view of them honestly guys these are a really comfortable pair of boots i highly recommend them um this is the back so yeah really lovely pair of boots nice and roomy definitely my favorite so far thumbs up this looks like a thumbs down but oh, can't do it yeah but you know guys they're nice Okay, so next up we have a long pair of boots now I have never worn a pair of boots this color but when I see them they really kind of just made me feel like wow they are chic they are stylish um, I definitely want to try these um, they're real leather as well they're real leather um, I definitely think these are a really fashionable pair of boots and I have just the outfit in mind to wear these. Um, I have a really nice coat uh, that everybody always asks me, where did you get that coat from? This pair of boots would go perfect with that coat. Um, so yeah, really, really like these. They are, um, what are they called? Let's have a look. They are called the Naomi X Extra Wide um boot in stone and they are a uh, size nine so i'm hoping that they fit they are very very gorgeous very very chic very very stylish um the only thing is obviously they only have like this little zip bit at the side which is like a, a like a nice dark brown color which is lovely um but it didn't say anything about having this top bit be an extra large calf and sometimes I do have to order like a bigger calf section um, so extra wide on the foot and uh, extra wide on the calf so um, that's the only thing I'm worried about with these but the detailing like this lovely crisscross bit here they just feel like a really lovely pair of boots um, so yeah let's get them on and let's see if they fit okay so here are the boots i have mixed feelings about these boots um so they feel absolutely lovely in terms of like the quality of them are beautiful um they're lovely and wide fitted at the front which feel very comfortable there's loads of room at the front as well and my feet are not like completely close to the end of the shoe which is lovely the heel um is nice size and feels very comfortable when standing however the calves are not big enough for my legs um, and as you can see um, because they're not wide enough at the top they're ruching all here um, which you possibly could get away with wearing them ruched um, and have that look but I personally would like them to be sort of pulled up a bit more um these are a lovely pair of boots and personally if you are not like big calf i would really recommend them i think they're a stylish beautiful pair of boots let me get up so you guys can see um as you can see they are very um ruched here at the front but they are so lovely like i really like these i love the color um, they're so comfortable. I love um, the square toe at the front. Very beautiful. They just look so lovely and stylish. I love that brand zip going up um, the inner uh, leg there. I'm just very disappointed that they are not big enough on the calf so I can pull them up and have them wear them the way they're meant to look. Um, but other than that, these are a beautiful beautiful pair of boots like they are everything they're so nice um i love these are beautiful so for me um they're a no-go because i can't pull them up enough um but other than that they are a thumbs up for me can't do a thumbs up like this but yeah thumbs up <laughs> next up we have these long boots which have like kind of like a chunky but flat sole so at the moment we're seeing chunky boots but they have kind of like a rigid bottom where these are kind of just like a nice plain flat more like a, a basic looking a chunky boot um and they are um a long 
boot which is kind of like over the knee which is nice and then you've got this stretchy bit at the back so love the fact that you've got the stretchy bit at the back because obviously that helps with um you know if you are a little bit more chunkier on the legs this helps because it, it is um giving you that extra bit of maneuver having this be stretchy um but yeah i do really like these i think they're really nice um they look like they're going to look lovely on um so yeah i i you know i haven't obviously tried any of these boots on yet i'm just opening the boxes for you and we're gonna look at them now together and then i will pop them on for you but yeah i really like these they're very nice they look like they'll be very comfortable um so yeah so we get them on and let's see what they look like on so these are the flat sort of chunky long boots and oh my god these are a dream they are so comfortable um they were quite easy to get on um in terms of like long boots they can be a little bit tough to get on but these were not and i think that's because of this back bit here it's like fully like elasticated i love the fact that these if i pull the camera up a little bit um i love the fact that these come up Let's see if i can get any shot there um yeah i love the fact that these come up um to my knees which are really nice um and yeah they just feel fantastic on um they've got a zip on the inside um i'm gonna come around on my chair but they've got an, a zip on the inside which i didn't actually have to open to get them on so that was um quite um good and and a good experience not having to open this zip bit they just um with this stretch they just kind of slide it on really really easy so that was good um let me stand up for you so this is what they look like with me standing up we'll go all the way back i don't know i don't know if that's getting all of them in the shot i'm not sure um but yeah they're a really nice pair of boots they're very comfortable i love the fact that they're completely flat across the bottom so there's no sort of sort of you can't feel anything it just feels lovely and flat and comfortable so yeah i like these these are definitely a thumbs up for me um and i definitely highly recommend these especially if you have big calves this is um a pair for you and they look super smart so yeah thumbs up for these ones love let me show you the, the back that's what they look like from the back absolutely lovely so yeah thumbs up next up we have these and oh my god these are just uh, a dream they are so gorgeous honestly i got so carried away with the boots by the way guys this is going to be quite a long haul especially in the boot section because i just found so many lovely boots and yeah i just i get carried away if i can find nice footwear i'm gonna get it because my feet are big and um it's very hard to find nice footwear so yeah i did get carried away and i wanted to show you what was an offer for us um plus size ladies wide fit foot ladies um so yeah these definitely are just a beautiful pair of boots so um they have like a lace going all the way up the back which is quite different like i remember when i was growing up we you know it was the thing to have um a lace go up the front of your long boot um but having this on the back just is so beautiful it's gorgeous um i'm just thinking if this is a wide carve i don't know if it is but the carve looks quite this section looks quite big i'm really hoping that they do fit uh they've got a lovely lovely heel and a lovely buckle along here these are a pair of boots that i definitely think will be timeless that you can wear um sort of year after year um so yeah really really liking the look of these and i can't wait to try them on and i'm just hoping that they do fit so yeah these are the next pair fingers crossed they fit okay friends so these are the boots that have the lovely lace at the uh, back of uh the decaling lace up the back um, and these beautiful buckles at the side unfortunately as you can see I only have one of them on um, and 
half on basically they do not fit um as i was taking them out um taking the tissue out i was like these look quite small and narrow um but yeah literally i can't even get the zip up so that's such a shame about these because they are a lovely pair of boots um but yeah i mean just keep in mind that these do come up small and they are not sort of big car friendly so these ones get a thumbs down for me in terms of fit but they are a really nice pair of boots so if you are smaller on the calf i definitely say give them a chance because they are a really nice stylish pair of boots but they just haven't worked for me today so okay so next up here are another pair of boots that i had um in mind for when i do sort of um the weekends doing sports with the boys my son does rugby and like it's very cold over on the field and i i'm in search for a comfortable pair of boots that are going to keep my feet warm and at the same time um have that sort of um bottom bit where i know that i'm not going to slip i feel sturdy on the wet grass um and yeah just um just yeah a nice pair of boots for having going over to do sports with the boys really personally that's for me what I would use these for um but they're great for if you're an outdoory person and you like to go for like uh winter walks and stuff like that or you like to walk the dog and it's over like a muddy field or whatever they're kind of like um and in between a comfortable welly and trainer um but you have like this kind of like padded um sort of top bit and like this furry inside which is lovely because that helps to keep your foot warm and then obviously you've got this kind of like trainery bottom more or less because the bottom is very very sturdy there's loads of grip there um, and you're going to be very very comfortable on your feet let's just pull this down a little bit let's have a little look on the inside okay so the inside um the inside has got a furry bit at the top and then this is just like a nice padded material on the inside. Um, they feel really nice and I'm actually hoping that these uh, fit. I think these would be more suitable for me um, than the hug or the Uggs or however you say it, the hug lookalikes um because yeah these are just a bit more suitable for walking on muddy grass and stuff so um yeah i'm hoping that these are going to be a thumbs up um because yeah i don't have anything like this i i do have wellies which actually i don't have wellies anymore because uh they were in the back of my car my car got stolen um quite a few months ago and all of our wellies and stuff like that football boots were in the back of the boot um so yes i don't have wellies but i didn't want to get another pair of wellies because i do find that wellies just really make your feet feel very very cold and they're very uncomfortable as well so um yeah i was looking for an alternative and so hopefully this will be the alternative so let's get them on and let's see what they look like on and how they feel is the most important so guys next we have um these boots oh my god these fit and feel amazing um they are so lovely they've got loads of room in them honestly they feel like they're a size 10 um because i have so much room at the front there which is nice um i honestly these are comfortable uh, they went up my legs really well i these are definitely a keeper for me because yeah going to um you know the fields i just really wanted something that was warm cozy and um convenient and these are perfect for what i want them for these would be perfect for walks um and just even like in the snow and stuff like that so i feel like these are like a a, a bit better than just wellies because they feel warm on the inside and they have this lovely sole which are a bit trainer like so there's loads of grip on them but yeah i really like these these definitely get a thumbs up for me i would highly recommend these um and this is what they look like on they're just really really nice a really nice pair of boots so yeah thumbs up okay so next we have these boots i thought they looked very smart a very nice pair of like low kind of chelsea looking boot um and yeah i have um my obviously 
uh, Shein ones, which are quite similar to these. But I obviously, a lot of these shoes are for you guys to see what there is an offer and to see how they look on my feet and for me to give you a review and for you to see exactly what would work for you in terms of comfort and um, just the fit and price. So that's what my videos are here for you. Um, so I didn't initially order these in terms of like having myself in mind, but these were definitely uh, with you guys in mind um, because I do think that they're a nice, smart, low um, ankle boot and would definitely be lovely with, you know, dresses and tights and um, jeans um, and leggings and whatever. So I do think that these are like a smart, nice pair of low boots. So yeah, definitely wanted to give these a try. And I love the fact that you've got this elasticated bit, bit elasticated bit all round sort of, it's just not cut off here it goes all around the back so this bit will give you that easier bit for you to kind of slip your foot into so let's hope that they're easier to get in um but i will tell you um how they were to get on and um how they feel so let's try them on and let's uh let's review them let's see what they look like on um next we have these boots um and i just wanted to show you before i actually put this boot on um, let me come a bit closer so you guys can see the inside. These have like a really lovely sort of tartan inside. I don't know if you can see that, but they've got a lovely sort of um, tartan material all on the inside, which are lovely. I also wanted to mention, these are so easy to put on. I will show you how easy they are. Like literally lift my foot um, and just adjust this back bit here. And I honestly was able to just slip my foot in like that. Now that is like the dream shoe or boot for me because um, again, like suffering with chronic illness, um, arthritis, I have pains um, in my knees and my ankles. So having a pair of boots that can slip on your foot as easy as that is like a dream come true. Um, these are really nice and comfy. They are beautiful in terms of like wide fitting. Um, they're lovely wide fitting. I feel very, very comfortable in these. I'm gonna stand up so you guys can see. Um, they look really nice. Honestly, these are, I can't actually believe how comfortable they are and how easy they were to get on. Um, I definitely highly recommend these guys. Um, they're a stylish pair of black boots. They are very in at the moment, like everybody's wearing these. They're just a beautiful pair of black um, boots. You could wear this with dresses, wear them with leggings, jeans, whatever. Um, but yeah, these are really, really nice. So I definitely recommend these absolutely lovely love them okay so here we have another long pair of boots which are extra wide calf i can see that already um it doesn't say it on the bag but i can see that these are extra wide um which is going to be lovely you've got this extra stretchy bit at the back here which is going to be lovely for comfort um they are i don't think these are leather no, because normally if they're leather, it will say on the boot, but they are really nice boot. They're lovely and like plain, um, but have the small um, bit of detailing. So you have this lovely little buckle that goes across here. Um, and just like the stitching and the shape um, around this front bit is really, really nice. Um, but yeah, they're just like a really nice plain long black boot. And I love the fact that they're like extra wide fit up the top and i love this sort of stretchy material the contrast of this and this material um is really nice i really like that on boots so um yeah let's try them on and let's see how they feel and how they fit okay so next up are these boots they're like a plain suede long boot i actually do have these um, myself but i have them in leather not the suede i have a few i do think i have like another pair of suede boots um because there was a point where all of the long boots were only suede you couldn't get like a really long pair of boots without them being like this suede material you you know and then um i see that they had a leather pair so i actually bought the leather pair last year um but yeah i do have a suede pair of long boots they're very very comfortable i must say the suede 
I like just wearing leggings on your legs and your feet feel very comfortable with them so in terms of comfort I definitely think the suede are that little bit more com comfortable I do think however they don't last as long um yeah the kind of like um faux leather or you know leather will definitely last longer um, and you probably could get a lot more seasons out of it than you would with these um but these are really nice and actually just realize that the studs um, that are going sort of around this section here are actually gold and on mine they're silver so that's nice I like the fact that they're gold um, I would however like a pair that are plain but they didn't have any that are plain and I haven't seen any sort of like for my size feet that are plain um, which I think would be nice just yeah I mean these with the gold are really nice but a nice plain pair would be great as well uh so yeah i'll try these on for you um i definitely think that these are going to be a winner um they do also have the um stretchy bit at the back which is great for comfort honestly these are like wearing a second pair of leggings um so yeah i definitely think these are going to be comfortable let's get them on and let's see what they look like on here we have these really nice um, high knee high boots with the gold um, stud at the top as you can see here these are really really comfortable as I said to you I do ha own a pair of these already um, but the ones I have are leather or faux leather um, and I think the studs on the top of my ones are silver whereas these are suede and then have a gold trimming like the gold studding at the top these are really comfortable, easy to get on. They've got a nice stretchy bit at the back. So yeah, really like these. Let me stand up. Maybe we might need to lift the camera a little bit so you guys can see what the top there. Um, so yeah, these are these ones. These are really nice. Like I would definitely recommend these boots because they're very, very comfortable. They're big calf friendly, which is great because they have the um, stretch at the back, as you can see there. Um, they they're really nice i would yeah definitely these are definitely probably my, in my top three boots um that i would highly recommend um so yeah very comfortable they're nice and wide fit and yeah these are like a pair of boots that i would just be happy to wear every day because they just feel very comfortable just feel like leggings <laughs> um and yeah very easy to get on so there you go a lovely pair of knee high boots love these so my lovelies that is the end of my coat and shoe boot haul um i hope you enjoyed it honestly this haul took it out of me i'll be honest it's taken me a few days to uh get all of this um together <laughs> um and try on all of those boots and coats um so i hope you appreciate this haul and i hope you enjoyed it um i will say there are these boots that i um didn't get to show you try and click just because they didn't fit um so yeah so keep in mind there was two pairs of boots that which were these and the other pair with the um lace back they were both very very small um in terms of sizing uh, lovely boots but just too small for me so um yeah did want to mention that uh so i hope you enjoyed this haul if you did don't forget to leave me a thumbs up if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please do press that subscribe button today um and i'll see you all in my next haul take care of yourself and god bless you all Mwah. bye guys